this is Dr. Lee once again and welcome back to my channel. So for today's episode, I will be talking about the possible research topics for the uh, for the social sciences and humanities or the humes. So humani the hume stands for humanities and social sciences and this strand focuses on the human behavior and societal changes and this would also include analysis of the arts, culture, literature, politics, and this uh, strand usually is a preparatory course for those who would be taking political science, anthropology, linguistics, psychology, communication, education, um, religious education courses in college. So I will be uh, giving you specific topics under the social sciences and it's up to you to develop it into a research uh, title. So I have a, a vlog also about how to make a good research title in a very simple, realistic, and practical way. So you will be uh, taking a course in research. Perhaps it's in the practical research one, the quality research, or practical research tool on the quantitative research. So you are right for you know clicking this channel, this video in particular, because I will be talking about possible research topics in the humanities and the social sciences and you know techniques and tips on researching, especially on the selection of a research topic. Because I am a researcher, a research teacher for the last 20 years. And a researcher, I conducted more than 10 researches already and presented it in the international and national research gatherings. So uh, the selection of a research topic is the most difficult part of research. That is my experience. So when you are selecting a research topic, the first thing that you have to, to remember is to look into your interest. Okay? So the first and the most important consideration of a good topic is what you find the most interesting and what you are most curious about. Choosing a topic that you like or wish to learn more is wise because you will be more committed to the rigorous reading that is required for a good research. So if your interest in a particular topic is very high, then expect that your energy to conduct the research would also be very high. And that would be opposite if your interest on a particular research topic is very low. So again, so interest is the most important thing to be considered when you are selecting a research topic. Then next is your area of specialization. Okay, so this refers to what course are you planning to take up in college? So do you know what you want to do for a living in the future? So choosing a topic that is in line with your future career is also a wise decision. Generally, students doing humanities hope to do something related with journalism, communication arts, liberal arts, education, political science, psychology, and other social science-related courses in college. But this is very general. So if you have already made up your mind about which course you would like to take up or to study in the future, then pick a topic related to it. So if you are thinking to become an educator someday, then you have to select topic about educational issues. So what are the major issues that our educational system as a country or even as a school is facing or are facing? So you, you look into problems because of the modular instruction, the distant learning instruction, inequalities because of the availability of internet and the non-availability of internet, okay? Attitudes towards uh, school, towards modules. Okay, so hobbies of um, hobbies of uh, children who are enrolled in in distant learning. 
Okay? So the coping mechanism of students. So if you are thinking of a career in the peace and order, like you would, you would like to become a policeman, um, a fire a fireman or a jail warden or in the coast guard or in the army so you have to uh, look into topics that are in line with those um, professions like peace and order situation okay criminality addiction uh cyber crimes deviant behavior okay so uh, those that involves um, crimes, those that the concern is on the peace and order situation or laws perhaps. So if your career in the future is uh, on the area of like psychology, okay, like a uh, guidance counselor, so you may select a topic like um, uh, addiction, okay, Disorder like anxiety, uh, addiction like drug addiction, social media addiction, uh, e-games addiction, and other forms of addiction. Then you may also select a topic like um, for disorders like anxiety, depression, social disorder, um, the Philippine value system. You may look into how how people consider suicide. No? The reasons, the symptoms, treatments, diagnosis, and others. So if you're thinking of a career that involves being a policymaker, like working in the government as politicians, as mayors, or if you want a career as a lawyer, or somebody that involves the implementation of the law, then you may consider topics that involves people with regards to the problems like poverty, so, how, how COVID-19 and the pandemic impacted the poor? So, problems about agriculture, problems about the uh, street dwellers, problems about um, urbanization, like uh, squatters, people living in the squatters area, uh, problems about people who are in conflict of the law, and so you may consider topics about violence, freedom, democracy, and uh, other other aspects of living life. You may even consider topics that that deals with uh, women employment, like uh, families and children who are left behind because their parents or one of their parents is working abroad. And so uh, problems of the overseas Filipino workers. So there are many issues that you may consider if you want a research that falls uh, on the topic about um, about public administration. The third tip that I would like to share is the topic must be challenging. Yes, for most students, picking a challenging topic is advisable because then you have an opportunity to learn more and to learn new things. But still, if you are finding the selection of a research topic difficult, then don't hesitate to approach your research teacher for more advices and for more direction. So good luck to your research studies and uh, if you want to know more about research, so don't hesitate to write your queries or your questions in the comment section. This is Doc Lee once again, and I hope that this very short video tutorial about the selection of the research topic under the humanities and the social sciences would help you in the selection of your research topic.